بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم أما بعد أي الله حبيته في الله it shouldn't be a mystery to any of us that Islam has a methodology or a madhab or a minhaj for us to follow the minhaj al-haq and that minhaj and the sabil or the way to practice that we can look at one hadith of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam which illustrates that for us which tells us who were the best and that lets us know why we should follow that path the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam said khayran nas qarni thumma alladheena yulunuhum thumma alladheena yulunuhum the best people is my generation then those who follow them and then those who follow them This hadith of the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam shows shows us that the minhaj, the methodology that we want to confine ourselves to, of of how we understand and practice Islam, goes back to the first three generations, and those first three generations we call them the salaf, the salaf of this ummah. And the Prophet sallallahu said, "Khair al-nas qarni." The best of people is my generation. Thumma al-ladina yulunhum. Then those who follow them. Thumma al-ladina yulunhum. Then those who follow them. So those first three generations, the Sahaba, رضي الله تعالى عنهم أجمعين, the Tabi'een, meaning their students, who follow them in righteousness. And their students, who met the Tabi'een and followed them in righteousness, that those are the best of the Ummah, and that is the path. So when we look back, we want to take our creed, our Aqidah. How would we understand Islam? It goes back to the Sahaba, and how we practice our Islam. It goes back to the Sahaba. رضي الله تعالى عنهم أجمعين. And that by following that path, you will not be led astray. But how many people claim to follow that path, and in fact they follow something else? And that's why the ulama they say al ibra bi hakaik. That the proof of something is in its substance, not in what it's called. So someone can claim to follow the Salaf, but their Aqidah does not support that claim. Someone can claim to follow the Salaf, but their Fiqh does not support that claim. Someone can claim to follow the Salaf, and their minhaj or methodology of how they practice Islam and how they give da'wah does not support that claim. And we ask for success in this life as well as the hereafter. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم